Hi guys welcome. Today we're gonna talk about the charging system and ignition system of a GY6 engine mounted scooters. Specifically the Star Gold LS125-3 or Lucky Star 125cc scooter, it is a Chinese rip-off of a Yamaha Mio 125cc carburetor type. These are the main components for the charging and ignition system of a motorcycle. Number 1. The stator or magneto, and the rotor. The stator or magneto is made from stacked laminated steel core, with the copper coil wires wrapping it which are placed inside the circumference of the stator. The rotor has magnets cast into a metal drum, the rotor is turned by the engine's rotation via crankshaft, while the stator is fixed. In addition, the rotor have a magnetic bump or a magnet out of its circumference, this is for the trigger or pulser to detect and sense it to the CDI or the capacitive discharge ignition. AC current and voltage are produced within the copper coil wires of the stator while the rotor spins around it. The stator of a Lucky Star GY6 scooter has eight coils of copper coil wire. Seven of these are connected, the purpose is for the charging and lighting, the other coil with black wrap is for the supply of the AC type CDI. The stator is connected to the body and therefore it has ground connection. The wire color coating of the stator are, red with black stripes, yellow, white, green, and blue with white stripes. Red with black stripes, this is connected to the CDI and powers it with AC voltage. Yellow, this wire is connected to the yellow wire of the regulator and supplies it with AC voltage, it is also connected to the auto enricher. The yellow wire powers them. In addition, this wire is sometimes referred to as lighting coil wire because it is the source of the headlight's power. White, the white wire is connected to the pink or white wire of the regulator and supplies it with AC voltage. It is sometimes called the charging wire because it is the source of the charging connection of the battery. Green, this wire is the ground connection for the stator. It is connected directly to the negative pole of the battery or the body chassis of the motorcycle. Blue with white stripes, this wire is for the pulser or trigger and it is connected to the red with white stripes of the CDI. Number 2. The Regulator Slash Rectifier the regulator or rectifier is a charging control device, it rectifies or converts AC voltage from the stator to DC voltage power output. In addition, it also regulates or maintain output voltage generated from the stator. The main function of the regulator is to maintain the fluctuating voltage from the stator and charge the battery. The stock regulator for the Lucky Star 125cc scooter have 5 pin connection, this is a full wave regulator. The five pin wires are colored, green, yellow, red with white stripes, pink or sometimes white, and red. The green wire is the ground connection for the regulator. The yellow wire supplies the regulator with fluctuating AC voltage from the stator. The regulator then maintains the AC voltage and supply them to the red with white stripes wire. In addition, this wire is also connected to the auto enricher. The red with white stripes wire is connected to a dark green wire, which is connected to the yellow wire of the right hand switch and powers the headlight, in addition, it supplies them regulated AC voltage. The pink wire or white wire is connected to the stator which supplies the regulator fluctuating AC voltage. The regulator then maintains and converts it to DC voltage to supply the red wire and charge the battery. The red wire is connected to a 10 amps fuse and it runs to the positive pole of the battery. The regulator supplies the red wire with a regulated DC voltage to charge the battery. Number 3. The Battery A battery is a device that stores energy, it basically provides the motorcycle with electrical power, it also supply it with additional current when the charging system can't keep up with electrical demand. In addition, the battery act as voltage stabilizer for the charging system. Modern scooters use 12 volts battery to run the starter, horn, and lighting systems. Other scooter use the battery to power the CDI, but the Lucky Star 125cc scooter's CDI runs on alternating current from the stator. The LS125 battery box dimension is 120mm in length, 60mm in width and 130mm in height, 
which is suitable for the 12N 5LBS with 5 ampere hour or more. Other model is also available with the same dimensions and higher ampere hour. The scooter's positive battery wire is color red. And it is connected to a 10 amps fuse before it runs to the ignition key switch and to the regulator red wire. When you turn your key to on, the ignition switch transfer the connection to the accessory wire, the accessory wire is color black for Chinese scooters and Honda motorcycles, it powers the horn and lighting system. In addition, a thick red wire connects the positive pole of the battery to a relay or solenoid that is connected to the starter and powers it. The negative battery wire is color green, it is connected to the body or the chassis of the motorcycle. Number 4. CDI or the Capacitive Discharge Ignition The Capacitive Discharge Ignition, or commonly known as CDI is a type of electronic control module that manages the ignition system of the motorcycle. It is a modern replacement of the condenser and sets of contact points as the control of conventional ignition system. The CDI is a solid-state ignition system which works and performs the exact same function as the contact points, but it is quite reliable because it has no moving parts. The CDI's main function is to manage the signal from the trigger, in addition, the main function of the CDI is to manage the switch of the ignition coil. As the stator rotor spins, the magnetic bump outside its circumference passes the trigger or pickup coil, then an AC voltage pulse or signal is generated and sent to the CDI where engine RPM is calculated. The CDI then converts them into the ignition timing data, which is needed to switch the ignition coil on and off and then the coil fires the spark plug. The CDI of a motorcycle varies depending on the brand or make. Some CDI have a 4-pin connector, 5-pin connector, and 6-pin connector. Some runs on AC voltage and some runs on DC voltage. Use manufacturer's recommended CDI on your motorcycle. The CDI of the LS125GY6 scooter is AC operated has a 6-pin connector and the trigger is AC pickup coil. The 6-pin wires are colored, blue with white stripes or red with white stripes, black with yellow stripes, black with white stripes, green, green, and black with red stripes. Red with white stripes, this wire is connected to the blue with white stripes wire of the pulsar or trigger located above the stator rotor, the pulsar sends signal to the CDI then the CDI manage the signal and sends power to the ignition coil. Black with yellow stripes, this wire is connected to the positive pole of the ignition coil. This wire is the output of the CDI. Black with white stripes, this wire is called the kill switch, this wire turns off the CDI when connected to ground. The kill switch wire is connected to the main key switch and kill switch on the right hand switch. Green, this is the ground for the CDI. Black with red stripes, this wire is from the stator and it powers the CDI with AC voltage, this type of CDI is called AC operated. Number 5. The Ignition Coil and the Spark Plug The ignition coil's main job is to produce spark, depending on what type of ignition coil, it steps up the electrical voltage from 14.5 volts which is the charging voltage to 20,000 volts or more. In a conventional ignition coil, the primary windings surrounds the secondary windings. The ignition coil's ground circuit can be turned on and turned off by an ignition module, computer, or points. The secondary windings produces high voltage each time the coil is turned off. This high voltage then travels along the high tension wire or the plug wire, to the spark plug, across the plug's air gap, and back to ground. The ignition coil wire of a LS125CC scooter consists of black with yellow stripe, green, and a thick wire. The black with yellow stripe is the power source for the primary circuit or coil, this wire is connected to the CDI. The green wire is for the ground of the primary coil. The thick wire is for the high voltage output terminal connected to the spark plug. The spark plug the main function of a spark plug is igniting the air and fuel mixture inside the combustion chamber of a motorcycle. The electrical energy from the ignition coil travels to the path and location of the spark plug to discharge. With the high resistance created by the air gap of the spark plug, the ignition coil must produce enough voltage to overcome it. There are many brands of spark plug to choose from, namely, 
Denso, NGK, Champion, and others. The LS125GY6 scooters compatible spark plugs are NGK C7HSA, Champion Z9Y and Denso U22FSU. Using the feeler gauge, set the spark plug gap to 0.6 to 0.7 mm. Thank you guys, that's all for this video. Stay tuned for other releases. Like, subscribe, and share. Peace out.